Well, Virginia's House of Delegates has now approved legislation granting freedom to mothers to breastfeed anywhere in the state, even at private businesses. Virginia is one of only a handful of states that does not have such a law in place. Caroline Tucker in our newsroom now with why an Alexandria mother says this law can't change soon enough. Caroline. Well, Allison, Olivia Blackman is a mother of five, and she's breastfed every single one of her children. And while she is allowed to breastfeed in public places owned, run, or leased by the Commonwealth, she was forced to leave an Alexandria rec center this week. The city says it was all a mistake. Yeah, go color. Go ahead, go color. Olivia Blackman is a Ph.D. student and mother of five. You guys have to play for five minutes and then we'll have chocolate egg. In the privacy of her home, Hello, baby. she breastfeeds her six-month-old daughter, Amelia. She did the same thing covered up at the Chinkapin Rec Center in Alexandria this week, which is run by the city. Attendant there said that, you know, um, it was part of the policy of the rec center that we can't nurse in the soft playroom. The city apologized to her. The city of Alexandria has no policy whatsoever prohibiting breastfeeding in any city facilities. We're very welcoming of all of our customers, and especially in a recreation center, we want for all families to feel comfortable. While it has always been the law to allow nursing in publicly owned spots in Virginia, a Virginia House of Delegates bill just approved will let mothers nurse anywhere in public and private private places. It makes Virginia one of the last states to do this. Yeah, I'm actually surprised it's taken this long for a conversation like this to happen. However, while the legislation allows nursing anywhere, it does not create penalties for those which don't follow it. Blackman just hopes soon breastfeeding doesn't have to be an issue. Our culture should accept it as something that is part of motherhood and should be, you know, embraced as something positive. The Virginia Senate will vote on a similar bill next week, which has bipartisan support. But the governor is expected to sign it. Meanwhile, there are signs like this that are posted now in all Alexandria City facilities, and employees received extra training about it today. Volunteers will also be retrained as well. Caroline Tucker, ABC 7 News. All right, thanks, Caroline.